Hello everyone. I am Ratana, the lightning cat. <sighs> yeah, I hear you over there. What are you mad about? What? What is this? Are you guys reenacting the Spanish Inquisition? Get the comfy chair. For fuck's sake. What? What is it? <clears throat> oh, I see. You guys want more food. Take this and plug it into that. There we go. That's plugged in. Now come over here, set this down right like so. Turn that on, turn this on. Turn that on. Wave for everything to stuff. Oh fucking hell. Turn you down or off, either way. I'm sick of the, the bullshit, so I tried to find a lawyer online to get help with this bullshit landlady being a bitch situation. <clears throat> it's fucking warm. Seriously. <clears throat> How did it get so warm? It's absurd. It's supposed to be like the middle of fucking winter and it's fucking warm. Something's wrong here. I don't know what. Tired. I don't want to do things right now. Ooh. Yeah, take that, Jack. That, that you, you can't show people you doing your full tilt, red hot gear all the time. Fuck's sake. Nobody's up all the time, like AV said. Look at me. I'm all over the fucking place. <clears throat> Legitimately all over the fucking place. Okay.
Yeah, in 15 minutes after you finish eating, you'll just be crapping on the floor again, Balto. Use the fucking litter box, man. I mean, you may be sick, but I watched you run clear across the entire place and back and forth twice and then just shit in the floor. That's fucked up, man. If you've got the energy to do that, you can clearly walk over to the litter box and use it. Fucking asshole. Someone I talked to said that they think he ate a, some bad frog or lizard. My thing is, how the fuck is he going to find one in the middle of winter? How the fuck does that make sense? <clears throat> it doesn't. Sign in thingy. Fuck's sake. Get that, turn it off. Get that, turn it off. Um. Open this bit here. Fuck you! Revving your fucking engine like a goddamn asshole. I've got no alternative. I'm gonna sue the fucking landlady. Or at least attempt to. Yeah, watch this flop epically as well. <coughs> I'm running out of options, everyone. You know it's so bad? It's that in prison I learned the truth about the fucking the the state government, the local government. They don't give a fuck about you, mate. Like one prepper I was watching said, "There's no red state or blue state. It's the state and you." And just like um, just like the asshats in in the fucking. The bureaucrats sitting up top, just eating all the fucking money out of everyone's mouths. That the Trumps doing the shutdown to get the fuck rid of. There's people. There's bitches in the fucking local, in the state, every fucking local and state that are equally as corrupt. And yeah, that every action taken by the police is unconstitutional unless they have paperwork backed by Congress. They can't hold you as a debt instrument because it's unconstitutional. It's a violation of all your rights. It says in the Constitution, no state shall make uh, Shall hold anyone as a debt instrument or some such nonsense or make payments but by means of gold and silver tender. Yeah, there it is. I remembered it. One dude showed me. 
in in the legal library. <clears throat> they don't want you to know the truth. They rely on your ignorance of the facts and the truth, so, and then they claim ignorance of the law is no excuse. Well, fuck you, bitch. Give me a goddamn legal dictionary here. Then in the fucking courtroom, they shuffle you around, and then they go and ask you, Are you okay with all the things that have been done here? What you should say is, Fuck, no, I'm not. I'm being held as a debt instrument, which is unconstitutional. You can't hold me, a flesh and blood, flesh and blood person, as a debt instrument. It's called slavery, bitch. Fuck you. I'm going home. Just like Eric Cartman in South Park. Who you get? And go ahead. Just walk the fuck out of the goddamn courtroom. Say, if you fucking touch me, I'll sue you. And there, there's several ways you can go about it. But just throw it all at them at once. Throw the fucking book at them. There's a no titles of nobility clause that states that, well, that's obvious. No titles of nobility, and your honor is a title of nobility. Officer of the court, yeah, no titles of nobility. So just remind them of that in the bar. B-A-R, British Accreditation, I forgot what R stands for. The first fucking word of the acronym B uh, in BAR is for British. The BAR Association is British run and owned. America's not fucking free. What the fuck are you talking about? still run by Britain, by the fucking queen, or the king, fuck all, man, officer of court, my fucking ass, I just woke up pissed off, <clears throat> this fucking bullshit, man, You know what? I'm gonna do that to the fucking landlady bitch. Her name is Jane Marlowe. Just gonna sue the living fuck out of her if I can. If this lawyer will help. I've explained my situation. Now just waiting for a response. What other alternative do I have? <clears throat> Can't get a fucking job can't get out of this shit situation any other way. Hell, I might as well, if I can't beat them, I might as well fucking join them. Fuck it, who cares? This shit's not fucking worth it. The bitch taking all my fucking money isn't worth it. So, hopefully, the lawyer I contacted will get back to me and I'll explain in great detail that I'm just gonna hold her as a debt instrument and take every fucking penny out of her Federal Reserve account which is uh, on a number on the back of your social security card it's what blue black or red I don't remember there's like three of them on the back
So that requires a bankruptcy lawyer. So I'm going to have to get a whole fucking team. And this bitch deserves it. <clears throat> this fucking shithole trailer I'm in. It's, I, there's holes in it I can stick my fucking hand through. <clears throat> the bitch is supposed to check in monthly. She's supposed to provide an exterminator service for the pests. She's supposed to provide maintenance and upkeep. She's not doing a single goddamn thing. She's not even checking in every month. I've been here for like four, almost five years. <clears throat> no, not a single fucking time has she checked in. Not a single fucking one. She hasn't done any of her fucking job. So fuck the bitch. If this lawyer will help me, pro bono, which means in the public's best interest because she's a public fucking menace to everyone living here, then fuck yeah. I'll take her whole fucking family down because they're all living in, the, in this place. Fucking probably rent free. I wouldn't put it past her. not doing a damn thing to fix this place and then the trailers were grandfather clawsed in I'm entitled to a livable condition and this is not fucking livable there's no fucking insulation under the floor from where her fucking idiot yokel moron chose to fucking rip it out and shove it up under another trailer. That's literally what the asshole said. He just pulls it out from underneath one and shoves it up under the other. There's no fucking care in the maintenance. It's fucking bullshit. Yeah, hopefully the, the lawyer will come over here, look at everything, get an inspection from and, and all kinds of shit because this place should be fucking condemned <clears throat> I'm not just gonna sue for my money back I'm gonna sue for every fucking penny the bitch is worth all of her fucking properties and assets every last fucking penny fuck it Then I went to talk to him about the whole bullshit situation where I was held illegally as a debt instrument. I'm trying to get something doing, done on that. The Constitution doesn't mean shit to these assholes, you know? Well, what was the band? One of the lyrics in their song was, The Bill of Rights is just a bill of sale. No, it was, uh, it was Slipknot. Was it Psychosocial? I don't know. You guys who remember, you bash it out in the comments. Well, that's how my day started. I just woke up pissed off about this shit. How was your day? Hey, yeah, like or dislike. There's links down in the description to support the channel so I don't have to do dumb shit to get money. And by dumb shit, I mean illegal shit. So I've already shown you guys the letter I got from where... 
the Department of Agriculture. Yeah, right, right fucking here. Here's the letter. Food Assistance Division, the Department of Agriculture. Yeah. Fuck's sake. The government shutdown is hurting everybody. Not just the bureaucratic bitches who have been feeding off of everyone's pain, suffering, and misery. <clears throat> so in February, food stamps gets cut off. How much longer until disability gets cut off? Which I'm on. How much longer? And then at that point, I have no legal option. I have to go over and do something illegal. I have no fucking choice at this point. Bullshit situations got my balls in a fucking vice grip, and no one gives a fuck to help. Till next time, bye.